Hi, for this recording, I will show you how to do 2009 MST question 5 part 2. Given the position at any time, the position at time t of a particle, in this case, is 3 cosine 2ti plus 3 sine 2tj plus 8t minus 4k. At time t equal pi over 4, we are going to find the value of a t and a n. What is this a t and a n? Given that a, which is acceleration, equal to a t times t, a n times n, where n is a principal unit normal to the curve, and t is a unit tangent vector. And how do I find a t? a t is velocity dot acceleration over the length of v. How to find a n? a n is velocity cross acceleration, take the modulus, and divided by the length of v. Actually, this is also given in Anton. If you look at the Anton chapter uh, 16, and this is what happened, you have a space curve. Alright, and this space curve, at any point, the velocity, you'll find that this is acceleration at any time is equal to, can be broken up into two components. One component is in the tangent direction, tangential component of the acceleration. This is AT times T, and this is a normal component of the acceleration which is an times n, and how to find this at and an in Howard Anton, in the later part it says that at is equal to v times a, v dot a over a, how to find at, an is equal to v dot the length of v cross a over v, length of v. So we are going to use this to find your at and an now. So in this case, to find at, at is v dot a over length of v. Now we have found earlier, v is minus 6i plus 8k, and a is actually 0i minus 12j plus 0k and the length of v is equal to minus 6 square plus 8 square using v equal to minus 6i by 8k and when we do the dot product you'll find that this minus 6 and 0 multiply get 0 and 0 times minus 3 multiply get 0 and 8 times 0 multiply get 0 so in the end this is equal to 0 alright so in the end this is equal to 0 over square root of 100 64 plus 36 is 100 which is 0 so a t is equal to 0 and how to find a n now a n according to the formula is modulus of v cross a over the length of v and what is v cross a now v cross a is equal to i j k where v cross a if we want to find out v is in this k is minus 6i plus 6k this is my v here minus 6i plus 8k so you put down minus 6i plus 8k and where is my j now my my a now my a acceleration is equal to minus 12j so you put down acceleration is minus 12j now when you expand this you get i 0 8 minus 12 0 minus j and minus 6 0 8 0 
plus k minus 6 0 0 minus 12 minus 12 and this will give you all together 96i by 0 j and then plus 72k this is v cross a and so the magnitude of a n a n is equal to magnitude of v cross a over the length of v the length of v we found earlier was 10 square root of 100 is 10 and this is going to be square root of 96 square plus 72 square now in fact this can be 75 because 72 and 96 there's common factor if you take out the 8 right or take out the 12 12 the 8 i plus 6 k so this is actually 12 copy of 8 square plus 6 square which is also 10 so this is 12 times 10 over 10 is 12 therefore I have found that a n is equal to 12 and a t is equal to zero. which says that the formula is this one a acceleration is a t times t plus a n times n so in this case a t is equal to zero times unit tangent vector a n is equal to 12 times principal unit normal vector and this is the equation we have found this is the solution for question 5 Part 2